Welcome to Divine Light Meditation, channeled by Ophenia and Sakal with the Family of Light. Very gently connecting to the threefold flame in your heart now. The pink love component, the blue light component, the golden empowerment component. And find your consciousness moving into this threefold flame. Let it absorb and transform any thoughts, emotions, worries, preoccupations that you may have. And then become one with this threefold flame as you expand it to six feet in all directions. And breathe it down to the heart of Mother Gaia. Receiving from her as you breathe up through your higher chakras to source, setting up your energetic pillar six feet in all directions from your core. You ask for the angels, archangels, ascended masters, and the karmic board to merge deeply and fully with us now through all dimensions of our fields. We ask for our God presences, our guides, our ascension councils to work in harmonious group consciousness together so the highest of the highest of the highest will be shown here today for all of us in our here and now. We ask for a temple of Mother Gaia grounding to anchor and activate through all dimensions of our fields. We ask for a temple of divine union to anchor and activate through all dimensions of our fields. Finally, calling on a temple of God Presence Communion to anchor and activate through all dimensions of our fields. Feel how all these energies, all these energy frequencies start merging around you, forming one energetic field with your pillar. Understanding that your God Presence, your spirit, your higher self is fully managing this session energetically for you. Placing your attention now in the God Presence Communion Temple. Ground your pillar deeply through this temple now. And take note of all the others here in the temple as well. Simply connect to the crystal at the core of the temple now, which may be a different crystal for each and every one of you. Receive from this crystal, send energy from your heart and your brow to this crystal. Receive from this crystal and build this energy up together, which strengthens your connection here to the God Presence Communion Temple. Also send your energy in two directions, to the left and to the right, forming two circles with all of those around you. One circle with the energy moving to the right, one circle with the energy moving to the left, which holds and seals this energetic space during this session as well today. Be greeted now by Ascended Master Melchizedek, Feel his loving, powerful, guiding presence with you. Connect with him through your 12 primary chakras and he will connect with you as well. As he greets all of you, welcomes you. Today's session, he explains, will be focused on creating an 
elevated consciousness for you, an elevated vantage point, an elevated expanded vision for you. Many of you deal with daily, weekly, monthly struggles and themes and issues. Sometimes you call them problems, he explains, in your daily life. And some of them have been with you for decades. Today, Melchizedek explains, we'll be working with your three most prominent challenges in your current life here on Earth. And we will be elevating your vantage point to a higher level than you've been able to obtain before around this particular challenge, assisted by your support teams and your God presence and by himself, Melchizedek says, you will receive new puzzle pieces to problems, challenges, and issues you've been facing for quite a while some which you perhaps have given up on, others which have you puzzled in your mind, he explains, and in your heart and in your soul. You don't understand why these problems are here in your life and you don't know how to solve them. You've asked for help and you've asked for guidance, yet you haven't been able to figure it out. These are the challenges for which you will receive further information, puzzle pieces, guidance, and also solutions or steps to solutions will be presented today, Melchizedek explains. Breathe up and down your pillar, and these solutions will come forth from your higher self, not your mind. Melchizedek has a smile on his face as he explains that he is sure that each and every one of you can list quite a few problems, challenges, and issues you are facing in your daily life. And in part, he says it is part of this journey here on earth because you grow through challenges and you learn from challenges. However, where you are stagnant and stuck, are the challenges where you have not been able to learn the lessons. And this has created a patterning in your energy field, which is not leading to further solutions. And for these particular issues, problems, challenges, it is now time to receive dispensations, further insights. These problems, Melchizedek explains, will not be solved for you you will still need to solve them yourself. However, you will be receiving further information, further clues, tips, directions, further insight into others who can assist you, further insight into events that may be relevant to you, places, people, groups, information, books, Or you may simply fall through layers deeper into the core of the problem, as you would call it. And all of a sudden, the light can shine there because it is actually falling deeper into the problem that you have been avoiding and you have been so afraid of. Yet, if you had done this earlier, you would have found out that these are nothing but mini initiations and when you fall through them, surrender into them, that's where the solutions lie. And this is the type of assistance you will be getting today. Some of it will be very clear cut and straightforward, Melchizedek explains, and some of it will be very cryptic, will be like clues, like a treasure hunt, like a puzzle with a thousand pieces. However, one thing is clear, Melchizedek explains, your higher self is committed to offering you a higher vantage point and more information and bigger parts of the puzzle, including next steps, than ever before. Now is the time, he explains. 
That being said, start receiving from your higher self what the first problem issue area is. This can be a relationship, this can be something to do with your passion, your work, something to do with your family, something to do with where you live, something to do with your health and anything else. So start receiving this now and this includes journeys to offer you these clues. The integration of this particular session will be seven days, one week, and in those seven days be very open and receptive to receiving more puzzle pieces, more insights, more help. So connect to your higher self. Now your support teams are opening up the space to a higher frequency than ever before, including myself, Melchizedek explains. So you will be able to look from a higher vantage point on the mountain. Simply receive now and take in all this information, not just through the mind, but through your entire energy bodies now. Not all of it will make sense to you, Melchizedek explains. Some of it, your mind or parts of you, will simply discard or feel been there, done that. However, trust that everything you are receiving now is leading to new, different, unique insights that will bring you to a very next level of this challenge. Be in the frequency of gratitude and trust as you receive. Be in the frequency of unlimited potentiality as you receive now. Be in the frequency of honoring that you deserve this. And you are right here, right now, for this particular reason. You have brought yourself here. Receive now to your maximum ability. The more you surrender into these frequencies and into this receiving, the more information coming from the highest possible resonance can be brought forth to you, Melchizedek explains. Be open to receiving gifts, crystals, karmic absolution, insights, old memory flashbacks, seeing faces from past people in your life or others that you simply haven't met yet. You may see colors, feel different emotions. Trust that everything you are receiving now is part of the puzzle. For some of you, there will be a moment of a click like a key turning and you will finally know your challenge has been unlocked. And yet for others, it will be like a mini piece is coming to you, but you feel the hope that it will lead to the next and the next and the next steps. Trust the timing of your journey as well as you receive more and more now.
If you are not clearly receiving anything, simply trust that you are getting the downloads that you need. And as best you can, Melchizedek says, get out of your own way, meaning allow your higher self to communicate as clearly as possible to you, supported by your Ascension Council and many others wishing only the best for you, including Mother Gaia, who supports you more deeply than perhaps you will ever realize in your earthly incarnation. Now, in the very beginning of this session, Melchizedek explains, you were asked to be one with the threefold flame, become one again with this threefold flame, and sit in this threefold flame as you receive yet the next level for this first challenge, the next level of information frequency. Also be open to emissaries from many other realms flooding in now, assisting you with puzzle pieces and keys. And these realms can be from literally anywhere. Venus, Andromeda, Arcturus, Sirius, Pluto, Mars, Inner Earth, suns, moons, other planets, Orion, be open to receiving from whichever realms have these puzzle pieces for you and hold no judgment as they come forth to you now. And this is not relevant to each and every one of you and will be very unique and different to each individual here. Now your God Presence is going to do things a little differently today, Melchizedek explains. For as you are still receiving on challenge one, the information for challenge problem number two is coming in as well. And this is done for a very particular reason. So your mind cannot get attached and create a lockdown for this information, all of it at once, is way too much for the mind, the lower mind, to grab onto. So, understand there are bridges and connections between your challenges and information for your second challenge next to information for your first challenge is being poured in now. From all directions, from Gaia, from other emissaries, from other realms, from other soul extensions, from your support teams, from the Ascension Council, from many, many others around you. Simply receive now while you hold frequency of your threefold flame, breathing up and down your pillar, for that is all you truly can do. This is too much to fully comprehend in one go, and this is why these problems have not been able to be solved so far by you, and this is why these dispensations are offered now. So simply receive them, understanding that over the next seven days, all will become more and more clear to you.
Your God presence starts flowing in information on the third and final problem area, challenge area now. 80% has been received for challenge one, 20% for challenge two, and the information for challenge three is starting to come in now. Do not try to grab onto everything with your mind. Surrender now. This is your time to surrender and trust that whatever your higher self can deliver to you, whatever all of your support teams can deliver to you is coming your way. That which is in the highest divine order for you. That which takes into account your free will and the journey you have chosen for yourself, including the timeline you have chosen for yourself within a realm of timeline potentialities. 90% complete on number one, 30% on number two, and 10% on number three now. Be your threefold flame. Explore the different feelings of the blue frequency, the light, the pink frequency, the love, and the golden frequency, the empowerment, bringing together the masculine and feminine energy in full divine union empowerment. Be immersed in this as all the other teams and your higher self in Melchizedek focus on delivering what it is you are entitled to in these dispensations. Sealing up the information download for number one now. Fifty percent complete on number two, thirty percent complete on number three. Simply be as deeply as you can, surrender, surrendering to the threefold flame within your heart. Let it be all of who you are now. And for some of you, that may mean a focus on the blue or a focus on the pink or a mix of all of them. Let it unfold according to your guidance as you surrender. So much is flowing into your energy bodies now so much for you to sort, yet you will receive information and steps very clearly on how to sort it and the sorting will happen very naturally as well over the next seven days. After this session, mark down what the three areas were that you have been guided to work on and receive downloads for and watch them transform. Watch them open where you did not feel there would be openings. For some, it will feel like many miracles. And to some degree, Melchizedek explains, they are
70% complete on number two, 50% complete for number three. Now gently while holding your connection to being within the threefold flame, start to project the threefold flame frequency visually out to the crystal at the core of the temple. So you see it in your heart through all of your energy bodies and through and around the crystal at the core of the temple. And pay attention to or connect into all others doing this as well. And place your focus now on that which occurs at the core of the temple through and around this crystal. This again will and may take you on a very different journey one that you need as puzzle pieces to solving and receiving and being guided on the journey of these three challenges. 80% complete number two and 60% for number three. Now let unfold spiraling energy, vortexing energy. Allow yourself to surrender to this now, letting go of anything, any breathing up and down your pillar. Let everything unfold now as it all comes together at this high, high, high frequency, Melchizedek explains. Allow yourself to dissolve into this now, here in the temple. As the remaining downloads will complete while you are in this feeling of timelessness, connected to all that is, all that you are, all time, space and dimensions. Simply be now. Keep receiving and simply be, allow yourself to be moved through this energy with this energy. Number two is complete. The last final burst for number three is coming in now. Allow this in by simply being. That is complete now and very gently Melchizedek explains. Come back to your presence in the temple, connect to being in the temple again, set up your pillar there, connect to the crystal at the core, connect to those around you, you have received a huge amount of information, too much to comprehend. Melchizedek explains, this will all be sorted by your higher self 
through all of your energy bodies, including your lower energy bodies, over the next seven days. Be open to any movement, including all the way to full solutions for these three particular areas you have been guided to work with today. Melchizedek, Melchizedek thanks you deeply for allowing him to assist you with all the other teams and blesses you deeply. So we ask for all this energy work to be sealed and to integrate with grace, ease, love, light, and empowerment. We thank all the support teams, Ascension Councils, Karmic Board, all emissaries from other realms, the temples, Mother Gaia, the angels, archangels, ascended masters, crystal at the core of the temple, Come fully back into your here and now, all of your consciousness from the temple back into your here and now. Form your pillar again, breathing up and down. Your pillar, come fully back into your here and now. Allow for this integration, knowing that a lot may move through you. Simply trust, trust, trust. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So be it, so be it, so be it. It is done. Deep, deep, deep blessings. Thank you.